Hello everyone and welcome to my White Glove review of the new DC Collectibles Red Hood figure. This figure was just released to comic book stores this week, uh, to yesterday to be exact, so he's available at local comic book stores as well as online retailers. He retails for about $20 to $25 uh, from what I've seen, maybe closer to $25, but um, yeah, he is really cool. I really love this figure for, for many reasons, which I'll go into. So first, let's just take a closer look at the red hood here. So as you can see, I mean, one of the, the best features of this figure is the beautiful helmet. I mean, I'm a big sucker for this metallic look on any figure. I just, I don't know, I just love that metallic look. So on the red hood especially, a little blurry there, it just looks beautiful. They did an amazing job with the helmet so well done on the helmet the uh, the jacket looks great the armor looks awesome um, it comes with the two guns and holsters that you know the guns are of course removable and also comes with two extra closed fist hands so there they are there but uh, yeah let's take a we'll pick him up and there he is so again I think the the helmet's amazing just the figure all overall is, is awesome. I love the boots, everything about him. So it's just a really well done figure. Now, as far as standing him up, he's doing pretty good. Um, there we go. So I had some problems earlier with my DC Essentials figures and standing them up, but not this guy. He's standing up pretty well so far. And sorry for the blurness there. There we go. So let's take a look at him with some other figures. Let's go ahead and show the original DC Collectibles Red Hood. So that is the original DC Collectibles Red Hood that uh, is based on the New 52 design. So you can tell by the, the art style. Kenneth, I'm gonna butcher this guy's last name, Kenneth Rancraft, I think, is the, the artist. Amazing artist, has a really cool style. And he did the art on the original Red Hood in the Outlaw, Outlaws comic, which this figure is based on the original Red Hood figure. So it fits that style very well. I'm also gonna put him next to our DC Essentials Batman. DC Essentials Batman. So there you go. He scales really well with him. He uh, looks awesome next to him. You know, I know I've heard some reviews saying that he's a little too big, maybe a little too tall. But I personally love it. I think it looks amazing. So um, yeah, overall, I love this figure. He's uh, really well designed. Really excellent, excellent articulation overall. Um, didn't have any paint smudges or any inconsistencies with the quality of the figure. And just overall, I think DC Collectibles really knocked it out of the park with this figure, and I highly recommend it. And if you enjoyed this video, I please ask you to, of course, like the video and subscribe uh, to my channel. I do appreciate the support, and uh, thank you so much, and have a great day.